Hi, welcome to Take a Break, Take a Breath for Wednesday, April 7th. My name is Rick Boyer. I'm the pastor of Prospect Presbyterian Church in Maplewood, New Jersey. And Take a Break, Take a Breath is an invitation for you to pause in your day to center yourself in God who made you and loves you and calls you by name. To take a few moments to pray the scriptures is the way I'm going to put it today. We've been reading through the Gospel of Mark, and each time I lift up a little bit about um, the passage that we're looking at, and today we're on Mark 1, 40 to 45, and then there's a guided meditation time to pray that particular um, passage or to meet Jesus somewhere along the road. This particular story is a story of Jesus healing a leper. The leper comes up to him and kneels before him and says, if you will, you can make me clean. And Jesus moved with pity, says, I do, I will be made clean. And then he tells the leper to go and offer him to, to the priests and make the offering that is required of him to uh, be clean and then to not say anything to anyone. He sends him away. But the leper can't be quiet. And before he even gets to the temple, he begins to tell everyone what Jesus has done for him. And so the word about Jesus spreads so rapidly and so much so that he's not able to enter any of the towns, but has to stay out in the countryside. The verse that I want to focus on is verse 41. Moved with pity, Jesus stretched out his hand and touched him and said to him, I do choose, be made clean. So I invite you, if you haven't already done so, to go to a quiet place in your house and to shut the door if the room has a door and settle into a comfortable chair and feel the support and strength of that chair. Feel it under your arms and the backs of your legs and on your back. Put your feet on the floor and feel the, the, the floor itself as it supports you. Close your eyes, take a deep breath. And as you breathe in, breathe in the breath of God. And as you breathe out, breathe out all that separates you from God. As you breathe in, breathe in the breath of life. And as you breathe out, breathe out all that does not give you life. As you breathe in, breathe in God's peace. And as you breathe out, breathe out all the worries and fears and anxieties that are hanging around in your mind and in your life. Continue to breathe deeply. Breathe in, breathe out. Breathe in, breathe out. Imagine the peace of God moving over your whole body. Imagine it like the water of a shower that falls down on your head and face. And as it does so, it brings relaxation to the muscles in your face, in your brow, in your jaw. And it brings relaxation to your mind. All the things that have been rushing around in your mind are calmed. And your mind is at peace. And as the peace of God moves over your neck. The muscles in your neck relax and the tensions melt away. As it moves down your shoulders and your arms, your shoulders relax and your arms feel renewed and your hands open up. And maybe you turn your palms up to receive God's peace and love. 
as it moves down your back, this, the peace of God, it brings relaxation to the muscles in your back. And the things that you've been holding, the tensions and burdens you've been carrying in your back are released if you let go of them. As the peace of God moves over your chest, your lungs are filled with good air and your breathing is deep and relaxed. And your heart, your heart rate slows to a calm and restful rate And as that peace of God moves down over your belly, your abdomen, any jitters that are there, well, they calm down. And it washes down over your legs, your thighs, and your calves, and your feet. You are relaxed and at peace in the presence of God from head to toe. And in your mind's eye, go to a quiet path. And there, coming up the path, you see Jesus. And you kneel before him. And you say, if you will, you can make me whole. see the compassion on Jesus' face as he looks back at you. And he says, I, I do be made whole. And he stretches out his hand, and touches you, and lifts you from your knees. and invite you to sit with him on the grass along the path and to talk about the places where your life may feel broken or not whole, where you need healing and compassion and love. I'll be quiet while the two of you talk for a bit. And then the time comes for the conversation to end. And the two of you say goodbye in whatever way is appropriate. And you know you can always come and meet Jesus again and again and again. 
and you allow that image to fade away and you bring yourself back to the room where you are and you open your eyes. Well, that's take a break, take a breath for Wednesday, April 7th. I'm Rick Boyer, the pastor of Prospect Presbyterian Church. If you have feedback for me or you want to talk or pray with me, send an email to rick at prospectchurch.org.